Slava from Handmade Rukodielky. In this video I will be working on the uh, heel part for 4 inch long baby espadrilles. Now that we have a sole for the espadrilles, we will work on uh, the back, this part, okay, on the back of the heel. With the chain stitches that you, when you were connecting these two parts, two soles together, so with the chain stitches up, this, this is my center, okay, and count eight stitches this way, and then eight stitches this way, all right, and mark your stitches. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, which is this one here, this one. And I will mark it and then I will count from that stitch eight stitches this way so one two three four five six seven eight and this is my other stitch we will crochet from one side all around to the other side and we will crochet through the back stitch of the um, of the chain. So now I will position my uh, sole this way, and I will start right at my first mark, right there, and I will make chain. So I pulled the yarn through and I make chain. Okay, and now I will make <coughs> single crochet stitches all the way to that mark and I will finish at this second mark. Okay, so through that back, this is front, this is back of my stitch, chain stitch. So on the on the back chain stitch I will start crocheting single crochet stitches okay so that's one and that's two it's a little bit difficult you have to have a good dexterity three four and continue all the way just like this to the uh, stitch to the mark to that mark stitch okay here I am in my last uh, stitch where is my marker so I will pull my marker out and I will make my last single crochet stitch so you should have uh, one chain in here and 16 single crochet stitches altogether 17 stitches okay now we will turn around bring this stitch just a little bit higher up okay and make in the first one make a single crochet stitch okay and continue like that uh, again all the way to the end make altogether 17 single crochet stitches again here I am at the end of my row and I still have two more stitches to do so this is my this was my first single crochet stitch that I did and this is my chain stitch that we need to go into okay and it's going to be a little difficult so you might have to help yourself somehow okay so that's that chain stitch right here that was our very first one and you will make single crochet stitch in there as well okay now you turn it out and you do the same thing again you make very first single crochet stitch right in there okay and so that's one and make six more 
one, two, three, four, five, six. So altogether seven with the very first initial one. And now we will do three single crochet stitches together. So you will insert your hook and pull yarn through first stitch do the same thing through the second stitch and do the same thing through third stitch okay so three stitches and they will go all together through all those four loops and now finish with seven more single crochet stitches one two three, four, five, six, and one more, and this is our seventh. Okay, now we decreased over here so it goes in, just like over here, so it doesn't fall off baby's uh, foot. Okay, it kind of curves in. And this is our fourth row. And you will crochet 15 single crochet stitches. One single crochet stitch in each. And again, we will start right there. Okay, so we will insert our hook there and make a single crochet stitch. And here we will make 14 more single crochet stitches to the end. One in each stitch. So we will do six stitches. So we will start again here. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, and six, this is our sixth, and now we will do three single crochet stitches together. So we will pull yarn through first stitch, second stitch, third stitch, and now we will crochet all these four loops together. Okay. And now we still have six more stitches to finish. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Okay. And we're almost finished with our back heel over here. And what I will do now is I will crochet 35 chains. That's what I did on this booty, okay, on this espadrille. This is my 35 chain stitches. And you do the same. Cut it off. Now we will crochet chain of 35 stitches on this in this corner, okay? I always start with two strings and then I try uh, and then continue with one. So 35 chain stitches, okay? Cut off your string and then I always fold my string like this and I make a knot. I usually leave this string a little longer so I can make a nice knot. Okay. If you have it too short you cannot make a knot as good. So I make a knot. And bring that knot as close to the tip as possible and now 
I just cut this very close here. Okay, and now we will do the same thing on this side. You can weave these ends with a needle, yarn needle, but I usually use very thin uh, hook and I just pull it through with my hook. You can do whatever you want. So this is it for today's video. Uh, please share my video and or comment. And uh, thank you so much for watching it. And uh, I will see you when we are working in our third video on the front part. Thank you. See you later.